So, front door's there, garage is there, will be the podcast cupboard is there, Azra's there to give you perspective, TV's there, and this goes through to our bedroom. So, go on through. We're super fortunate that on this side we've got those double windows, which is lets so much light in. You can see my laundry there, sorry, not sorry. Um, and let so much light in, I love it, I love it. And I think once the garden's done, it's gonna look so cool. Like, this is where we're gonna do the decking. That line of plants is gonna go. Decking's gonna be on that side. Um, we did toy with taking down that fence, but for security, we're not gonna do that. Um, we've got good security on the house as well. Like we've got a built-in alarm and all of that stuff and cameras, which is really, really good. I think that gate just adds a bit more security, so we're not gonna take that down, but, um, yeah, this is going to look so good. So that's the door there that I came out of the laundry room. And that long window back there is our kitchen. And then the other side of that grey gate is our garden, if that makes sense. So, um, yeah, it'd be nice once that's all decked and all this wood chip's going to be gone. Ahmed absolutely hates it. I think it bothers him more than it bothers me. So that's all going to be gone and that's going to be kind of fake grass. So up until that line of bushes you see is going to be decking. And then from there, all the way down past the pool, down to the trampoline is going to be that fake grass. So yeah, like I said, keep an eye out for that. This is Ahmed's side. So he just has two drawers, candle and a lamp, really simple. Um, excuse those white pillows at the back, our pink pillowcases are in the wash. Um, yeah, we just got a few pillows on the bed, I love a good pillow on the bed. I changed this little throw out this morning that was green the last time I think you guys would have seen it, but I just thought, you know what, change it out, put a bit of grey, makes it look a little bit different, spruces it up. Uh, let's see. Computers on charge, phones on charge, because you know, vlogger life. And this table I just bought in here today as we were tidying up from the living room and after Christmas. I just popped that there. There was a green chair there before. I'm trying to phase some of the green out of this room. I love this this picture of this plant, so I won't get rid of that, obviously. Um, but just trying to phase out any of the green accessories and just have that a plant and then a the couple of pictures around the corner. So I just popped that there with a little plant and a little candle that candle was one of my christmas presents from the kids which was gorgeous and then a little buddha with some um wax melt in the top uh, like i said stuff's charging down there and then you kind of so, oops just stepped on my laptop gosh go back here and um, that's an overview of the room just to give you kind of perspective your double windows so I think it looks a bit bigger without that chair here. And then you kind of come down and round, and it's my side of the bedroom. Got a flower, I think it's called the Mother Indoors Tongue. Um, low maintenance um, plant for the bedroom, air purifier, um, a little tray for my um, water in the night time, and then some crystals that a colleague bought for me. This window. It's not my favourite at the moment, but do you know what? Again, first world problems. Makes my son happy. The reason it's not my favourite is because you can just see trash from here. So you can see the pool. Um, that's a cover for the pool. We just took it off so it can heat up. Um, yeah, and that's the pool from the other side. So it's not, it's not my favourite view, to be honest. And there's the ladder to get in the pool. And as you can see over there is the trampoline as well. So like I said, not my favourite view, but that's why problems 100%. Like I said earlier, my house is not a museum, so um, kids live here. And then this is, let me put this light on. No, oh, that didn't make any difference. <laughs> uh, this is the hallway um, past the dreaded window to our closet. Um, it looks really weird because up until obviously Christmas, it had loads of presents um, up the top. So that whole thing was full up and it looked so cool. Um, but yeah, this is Ahmed's side. So quite organized. Um, some boxes up there with some, I think it's got his ties and stuff in like that, cufflinks and things like that. Uh, this shelf really annoys me so much. One of the things I said when we moved in was I was getting this side because you can kind of see it and I know I keep things a lot more tidier than him um, and you can see it's the first thing you see um, so the only time I see that is if I'm coming out the toilet or the shower so you know I can I can live with it um, and this is my side again not super super organized look at that bottom shelf what the what the what um, 
I tried to keep everything kind of colour coordinated as much as possible um, but we just put some laundry away yesterday so it does look a bit chaotic then I just did some decorative stuff up there I think I don't know what that is back there I think it's an internet box maybe I don't know who knows there's a box back there if you can see and I think it might be so I don't know what it is. Um, so I just used, you know, Joe Malone bag to cover that up. Um, and then just some decorative bits up there. Um, again, it's stuff that came from the old house. So we repurposed it. Um, long stuff here. So dressing gowns, armored jumpers are now at the top and all these t-shirts are at the bottom. Um, I've got the opposite. My jumpers are at the bottom. And then other stuff at the top but also includes jumpers I've got a bit of a mix to be honest I'm not as organized as Ahmed and then here are all my dresses and my longer clothes like um, jumpsuits and stuff like that and then I've got my perfumes and, and all those bits and bobs this is something that we bought with us from the UK uh, he said there's only one thing I want to change about you your last day so I thought that was quite fitting so I put that up the other day and then in here is just our little ensuite. So yeah, nothing special. Nice little shower. Um, and that's it really. Hair products down there, and you know, with this with this mop you gotta you gotta have quite a few. You gotta have a few options if you know what I mean. And then this is different. I put this in. And I don't know, I don't think Ahmed's a fan, so I wanted to clear that off. Um, or I wanted to have one or two things out there, but the problem is, you have to have cleaning stuff, you have to have stuff to scrub your feet. We are in a mixed race um, relationship, if you can tell. Uh, <laughs> and so we need different, this is again first world problem, but this might be quite interesting for people, I don't think everybody knows. We, need, we basically use five, different hair products in this house so Ahmed has his own to wash to condition and then to style I have my own for the same Junaid has his own Safan has hers and Daniel has his we've all got different completely different hair that we can't use one hair product so it's super expensive um, but it also means you've got quite a few bottles out in the shower because everybody needs their own hair stuff right um, so yeah I just thought I'd share that it's something that um, people might not know and then up here are those prints that are finally up I think on the last vlog um, they were down there on the floor they were down there for a month I think and then we put them up um, so they're really cool I love these these are from um, Kmart and we decided to get two that are the same and you might think see what if you can spot it do you think that they look um, that one slanted comment down below we thought that they were, and we were like, oh man. We measured it and everything. There was a whole game going on. We, we planned it out and everything, but it's not. Do you know what it is? It's the shadow on this picture that makes it look like it's curving in, that they're curving in at the top, but they're actually not. We measured it and we use a spirit level. Um, so yeah, fun fact, we did put it up and actually it didn't, um, it didn't bow like, like we initially thought it did. Um, oh, and then as you come out of our bedroom, you just have a little hallway here, that's the overflow cupboard, and then just some pictures that we got when we went to Spain. And there was a guy that was painting them on the street, so um, we paid for them and we bought some nice frames from Ikea, so um, we put those up <coughs> as a little bit of a, a memory from, from one of our travels. So I want to thank you guys so much for sticking with us throughout Vlogmas and throughout our journey so far. Um, we're definitely, definitely enjoying the, the daily vlogging. It's let us know that we actually can do it and we can be consistent in the content that we put out. So we're probably going to aim for, I think, two videos a week and see how we get on. Um, but in December, we're trying to, we're probably going to put up a video kind of every day in December still. So from the 25th till the 31st. Um, and then from January onwards, we're going to be um, putting out at least two videos a week. So, like I said, thanks again so much for hanging around. Thank you, everybody, for your support. And um, what have they got to do, Ahmed? Oh, Ahmed's not here. Guess it's down to me. Like, comment, share, subscribe. Like, comment, share, subscribe. Like, comment, share, subscribe. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one.